The double-bladed lightsaber is an incredibly powerful upgrade in Jedi Fallen Order. It gives you access to the double-bladed fighting style, which is excellent for crowd control, fighting multiple enemies at once, that kind of thing. If you want some more information on how to use it, please check out my combat guide for Jedi Fallen Order. In this video, I'm going to show you how to get the double-bladed saber as early as possible in your Fallen Order playthrough. There are multiple points in the game where you can get it, but this is one upgrade you're going to want to have as early as possible. So I recommend traveling to get it as soon as you're done with the vault on Bagano. As you're traveling back to the Mantis from the vault, you'll come across this mural which BD-1 will run up and scan and you will get a hologram of Master Eno Cordova telling you that the Zepho have had some interest in the planet Dathomir. And then when you get back to the Mantis, you will immediately have the option to travel to Dathomir. And this is where you'll go to get the double-bladed saber. It's not where your main objective is until much later in the game. But you can travel there now as kind of a side quest to get the double saber. The enemies there are tough, but it's definitely a worthwhile excursion. When you arrive on Dathomir, from the ship, head to the right. There's a path that'll take you to some vines on the cliffside that you cling to. You'll get a little cutscene with this creature, which is a very tough fight. If you're not feeling up to it, maybe try to avoid that creature when you get to the top of the cliff here. Now, if you look at your map here, you'll see there are multiple directions that you can go. And they all generally take you in the same direction. They all kind of converge, but the fastest way to go is to head to the right, climb up on top of these ruins, run across this wall. Now, there's one of these spider creatures here. These spit corrosive acid, and they're actually fairly difficult on tougher difficulties. Force run on this wall, jump up onto this ledge. There's more spider creatures here. After you defeat them, climb up this wall here. You'll find another spider creature up here. And once you've dealt with that enemy, head to the right. Force run across this wall. There's a chest here that you can grab if you want. Then head in this direction. And aim for this wooden platform over here. More spiders to fight. And then you can cut the line on this sort of crane-like contraption here. And this opens up a shortcut. This is where that first creature that we saw was, where all those branching paths were when we looked at the map. From here on out, when you come here, you can just grab this rope, it'll bring you up to this wooden platform and you can skip all the stuff that we just did. From here, head around this way and up into these ruins. You're gonna get a cutscene here that features a Knight Sister. She summons a couple of Knight Brothers. They're going to attack you. Once you've defeated them, exit on the far side of the room. There's a couple of swinging ropes here. Use these, and uh, here you'll find a meditation point where you can save your progress. Continue forward, head up these stairs. More Knight Brothers to fight here. One melee unit and a couple of ranged units. When you get to the top of the stairs, you'll do a U-turn. Head along this ledge here, and head further into the ruins. There's a Knight Brother waiting around this corner. Try to avoid getting hit by him if you can. Head up the stairs to get out of this room. Another Knight Brother's gonna jump you in here. Around this corner is a ranged unit that's gonna shoot at you. And another melee Knight Brother hiding around this corner. Chest right here that you can grab. Then continue forward. You'll have a couple of guys shooting at you from a ledge in here. Best to eliminate them before you try climbing up there. That's your destination. Once you've dealt with them, Wall run here up to this branch. Take it across the room, wall run again, and you're up on the ledge. Continue onward. When you get out into the open air here, you'll see you're right above the meditation point that you used earlier. Don't hop down or you'll have to climb back up. Head in this way. Couple enemies down in this room. There's also a chest you can grab. Head out this doorway on your left, follow this corridor around, and right in front of you here you'll see a giant door that you can open. And this is another shortcut you can open up. This leads you to the top of the stairs that's right above the meditation point that you used. Alright, from here you are almost there. Head over to this ledge. On the other side of this gap there's an old hermit that you can talk to as part of the plot. You can talk to him now, you can talk to him later, doesn't matter. But if you head around this way to the left, you'll come across a workbench. Interact with this workbench, and Cal will upgrade his lightsaber to a double-bladed saber. 
I'm not sure exactly where he found the other emitter to use here, but that's how it works, and that is the quickest way to get access to the double-bladed saber. And you can now head back to the Mantis, you can use those shortcuts you unlocked, makes it a nice, quick, easy trek back, and then continue along with the main story. You can also explore Dathomir a little more if you want, there are places you won't be able to get to yet, but if you want to find things to scan or open more chests, that kind of a thing, you can do that too. Alright, hope you found this helpful. Please don't forget to slam that like button if you did. Also subscribe and hit that notification bell for all kinds of gaming content. I've also done a general combat guide for Jedi Fallen Order. You can check that out as well. Thanks so much for watching. I will talk to you again very soon. Thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to like, sub, and hit that notification bell. And then check out some of these other videos. Find the link to our Discord server and other important stuff in the description below. Okay.